In this tutorial, we will learn about fillet command. Keyboard shortcut for a fillet is F. Enter. Then at first, you will have to set the radius. Click on radius. Then give the radius value. 3. Enter. Then select the first object and second object. It will create arc between those two lines. If you want to give fillet command from ribbon, here is the fillet command. Click there. And if you don't want to trim the lines and still want to create the fillet, then click on this trim option and click on no trim. Then select the first line and select the second line. It will create the fillet but it will not trim the lines. Again fillet. Then next option is multiple. If you want to fillet multiple times, click on this multiple. Then select the first line, second line. Fillet is still on. I don't want trim option. Set to trim. Then you can use the fillet multiple times. In between if you want to change the radius. Here is the radius option. In between you can change the radius if required. Again select the next line. Again radius I want it to. In this way in multiple option you can change the radius also and you can keep on doing the fillet. And if you uh, cancel the last fillet you can click on this undo. So it will cancel the last applied fillets. And if you want to apply fillet to polyline object. Let's see. Now this object is not polyline. You can convert any object into polyline quickly using join command. Click on join. And select all the object and enter. Now this is a polyline object. If you want to fillet all the corners in this object, click on fillet. Select the polyline option. And radius is already set to 3. If you want to change it, you can change from here. Suppose I will change it. Radius, I want it to. And select the polyline object. So it will fillet all the corners of the polyline. Fillet command can also be used to create a slot. If lines are parallel, you can fillet it also. Click on fillet. Select the first line. Select the second line. Again, enter. First line, second line. So in this way, you can use the parallel lines to create the slot. You can also use fillet to connect the lines or create the corners. Click on fillet. Then select the first object. Then here is the one option is shown shift select to apply corner. If you want to create the corner, press shift button on the keyboard and click on the object. So it will automatically trim the next object. Again fillet, you will take the multiple option and select the first object, press the shift. That means to create the corner, it will extend the object if required or it will trim it. And in this way, you can by keep the shift pressed in this way you can use the fillet to create the corners that's all thanks for watching we will stop here